Welcome to another episode of Weekly Interesting Tech. Uh, this time around, I have five new technology uh, releases over the past week that is very, very interesting, and I hope you like it. So without further ado, let's go straight into it. Crave for homemade food? Yamit is a C2C marketplace platform for home chefs and those that love food that are made from home. The main issue I can see is the quality and the health issues that goes with such cooked food. If someone gets food poisoning, who is going to be blamed? It is currently available only in certain locations, but I don't think this will be coming to Singapore anytime soon given the legal concerns. Need to access multiple accounts for testing and development purposes? Or even for your companies and businesses that maintain several different social media accounts and whatnot? Ghost Browser has all those covered with its multi-session browsing. On top of that, get more productive with its task-based browsing and the productivity sidebar. Ghost Browser is built on top of Chromium, your Chrome browser, so it is safe and efficient as one of the top browsers out there. Ever fell asleep on the public transit on your way home only to find out that you missed to alight at your stop about 15 minutes ago? I've experienced that before many times during my secondary school years. Fret not though, Google has just introduced step directions for transit navigation. Never miss a stop again. Writers, bloggers, website owners, WordPress users out there, have you ever found yourself scurrying to find an image to illustrate a point, or simply looking for an image as a featured cover? Pixabay has just released a major update to its WordPress plugin that allows you to quickly and easily look for images that you can use in your article. Pixabay has some of the most amazing collections of public domain pictures that you can certainly spice up your website and your articles. Remember the good old days where people pin badges on bags and shirts and whatnot to express a certain ideology or to simply look cooler? Beam is basically badges 2.0 and lets you create dynamic interactive badges that can express yourself in a variety of ways. Simply use the given app and you can customize the badge to display any of your content. Pretty damn neat, I would say. You could also broadcast information through the panic button and send customized messages to recipients nearby. I hope you enjoyed this week's interesting tip tech and if you have anything any suggestions any products or releases that you would like me to know and share with people do just uh, private message me or even leave a comment below otherwise if you like this series or you have any suggestions also do let me know or subscribe for more of such videos i'll see you guys again next week